Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try one of these El Monterey Signature Burritos. This one is the Egg Sausage and Cheese Burrito. It is 4.5 ounces or 128 grams. It says it's made with real scrambled eggs and fresh baked tortilla, cook and serve. And we bought these at Kroger. They were only a dollar, which I think is a pretty good price if you ask me. Um, this going to make some noise, so sorry. Ugh. It is 300 calories per burrito, and hopefully you can see that. Tammy will have a picture if not, but you know, kind of, I can't tell if it's clear or not in there. But there you go. Um, so directions for cooking. So you can do this in the oven. I've never cooked one of these burritos in the oven, but you can. There's the directions if you want. I guess you could do it in a toaster oven if you want. I don't know. Anyway, we could do the microwave. So we're going to um, cook it on high. Cook one burrito at a time. Um, uh, open one end of package to vent and from frozen do one minute and 30 seconds and let it set for two minutes before eating. Wow. So you're just going to basically open this up to vent it and, um, put it in your microwave. I usually put it on a paper plate just so I don't have to deal with getting out of just a package and pull the whole plate out. But anyway, I'm going to get this in the microwave and I'll be back. All right. So here it is out of the microwave. I, I've let it set for the two minutes it said to let it set and, uh, I'm going to knife here. I'm just going to... Stab it and rip it open. It's still a little soggy looking. So that's what it looks like. And the top is very uh, like wet. So let me see if I can cut it and you can see what's inside. Should be some, I see this, the egg. I see a little seasoning in there. I see cheese. There's a piece of sausage right there. So it does have some sausage in it. So I'm gonna, I'm going to cut these into smaller pieces just so it's easier to eat on video, honestly. It's not uh, not because I normally eat them like this. It's just easier for me to eat them on camera if they're smaller pieces. So anyway, I'm going to do that and take it over the table. I'll be right back. Okay, right, didn't let it cool off really. I did grab a fork though because the egg is busting out of this thing so much that I got a fork. It'd be a little easier to eat with a fork. The tortilla itself, the I got a piece out of kind of the middle. It's very, um, it's kind of almost chewy. Um, let me try it on the end. The um, I get the egg, the texture of the egg. I get the texture of the sausage, the cheese. Um, you know, it adds a little bit of a, a creamy texture in there. The uh, the sausage, it does have a little spice to it. It's not like really like it's definitely not burn your mouth kind of spice, but there is a spice there. You can tell it's a spicy um, or spicy. It, the, the sausage has some savory spice in it. There you go. Even the end of the burrito was pretty, um, pretty tender. So if you ever had any of these burritos, I've had a ton of them. Um, the ends where it's where it's folded over, or double over, it's really thicker. Really gets like hard. Um, almost to the point where you can't eat it sometimes. I mean, it's very, very dense and hard and crispy. Um, these don't like that. They're tougher, but they're not as uh, hard as, as they can get. I like the flavor of the sausage. The sausage, like I said, it's spicy. It's spiced, but it's not spicy. Um, it's just got a good savory flavor. Um, overall, I mean, it's okay. It's not, you know, Best thing I ever ate in by any means, but it's good. It is really good. I'm gonna give it a three and a half um, out of five. I do think it's it's a little above average as far as flavor goes. It's um, it's you can actually get the flavor of those elements in there. Um, the tortillas are good. They're not great, but they're good. Uh, for me, if they'd add a little salsa in there or a little bit more spice to it, or you get a little bit of that tomato, onion, garlic kind of flavor mixed in with like a little salsa. Um, that would have been really, really good. But the way it is, it's still pretty good. So three and a half out of five, I think it's fair. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.